coming up next. It's a UFC featherweight division fight. Tonight, his takedowns are really some of the best in the game. So explosive, great technique behind them. Certainly, you see shades of his collegiate wrestling career. His opponent's got to watch out for those, but even an opponent with good takedown defense will succumb to this guy's shots. No telegraph behind him. When this guy wants to take you down, more often than not, he succeeds. This guy has some of the best defense I've ever seen inside the octagon, and they say that defense is the best offense. So here he is, the biggest superstar in mixed martial arts history, the former two-division UFC champion, Conor McGregor, back in a mixed martial arts setting for the first time in a long time. Of course, many of you ingested his boxing match with Floyd Mayweather. Thankfully, all of that is in the past, and Conor McGregor's present is a return to the greatest proven ground in MMA here tonight. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. for this featherweight fight. McGregor is two years the elder. He will have a one-inch reach advantage. We set it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding professional record on. 15 wins, one loss. He stands six feet one is tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of the Republic of Dagestan, Russia, Zombie Magomedsharipov! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This is a holding professional record on. 21 wins, three losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting at a Dublin Island, the notorious Connor McGregor! All right, commit the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times. Protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners. This is gloves. a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. All right, you ready? You ready? Let's All right, we are on the way here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas, Nevada. And how about the buzz in this arena and just the sheer volume from these fans as Conor McGregor makes his return here tonight. Now, how will he approach the early portions of this fight? That is the big question. We know he's had some quick finishes in his UFC career, but a lot of people think he'll want to feel this thing out and get his feet under him early. Yep, not a ton behind it, but it landed. Joe, your thoughts on what we'll see in this matchup tonight? One thing to keep an eye out from Conor McGregor are his kicks. Very unpredictable, very creative in his kicking technique.
much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Connects with the punch there. Both fighters a little bit hesitant to engage, feeling each other out. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by McGregor. And there he swung with the haymaker. Just a slip there. Well, his opponent found an opening there to the body. Nice hook shot there, but as he leans forward in trying to get into his own striking range, he's gonna pay the price there to the body. Gotta be careful. You don't wanna eat too many of those power hooks downstairs. Big punch. McGregor gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he responds. Well, not wasting any time working on chewing up that lead leg as he lands his first leg kick of the fight. Clean punch. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, lands that punch. Good inside leg kick. Hit him with the jab. We cross the midpoint in round one. Switching stances here. Nice punch there by Connor. Front leg side kick, very effective. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. Good shot. Attacking the body now. That shot blocked. High kick. Nice punch by McGregor. Oh. Looked like it did stun him a little bit. Hurt him with that right. Can he hang on? Oh, he might be out. There's a nice inside leg kick. Looking to the left hook. How about that shit? Oh, oh. he is stumbling. Body kick, look at that. Look at that jab, nice. Inside leg kick lands and immediately a mark on his opponent. High-level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by McGregor. Oh! Oh, nice strike landed there by McGregor. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Front kick to the face. Oh, that cut on his brow is looking ghastly now. You lose blood, the weaker you get. Goes high with the kick and lands right there to the head. So we know that's a big part of his game plan tonight. And he didn't waste much time getting a land with it early. Now a level change. Went kick. Oh, switch kick lands for him now. Well, so he gets clipped once again here, Joe, and he continues to be vulnerable by leaning in. He's keeping his head on the center line. He's got to change things up a little bit here. Try to establish that jab. No. Oh. The left hook hits home. Oh, beautiful hook. Big knee to the body. Oh, good combination. He lands with the left. Oh, that's a good strike there by McGregor. The horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, well, that's the end of the round, so the location is okay, the cut on the cheek, but that is some serious blood trickling out of that cut there. You got to think maybe at some point they call the doctor in, and if he doesn't like what he sees, maybe they stop this fight. And here's another beautiful leg kick. And there's another excellent leg kick. We really got a chance to see some awesome action in that round. Brittany Palmer in the building tonight. Okay, ready? Round two. You ready? Second round here. 
starting off this round, you've got to think he's probably still hurt from that last round. He's going to want to move and avoid taking damage early. Oh, nice jab by McGregor. Just misses with a left hook there. on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, and try to get his opponent out of there by landing more than just one strike at a time. Oh, there's the head kick. Looked like there might have been a window there. Instead, it is blocked by McGregor. Oh! Trying to get a single. Body kick is blocked. He's looking for that left. Well, Gregor gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Got to shore up the defense here, though. Nice inside leg kick. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it. So let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. That one hurt. Now they are throwing both sides with conviction. Oh, he's hurt! He's hurt! He's gotten hurt here. There's a nice inside leg kick. Oh, man, that one is nasty. Well, you know these leg kicks, Joe, are a big part of his arsenal, but I'm not sure he's been better with it than he is here tonight. Visibly now, his opponent has started to slow down. Level change there. Conor McGregor gets caught by the inside leg. He got tagged there. And he continues to work on the inside of that lead leg. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. Oh, another one. And now he lands a combination. This could be it right here. He hurt him again. Oh, big left hook there. He lands a giant kick. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Into half guard here. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. Now he's in half guard. Busy as he looks to improve position here. Lands a strike now from the bottom. Nice work there by McGregor. 90 seconds to go in round two. He hits him with a hammer fist. He's now back to half guard. All right, so he just decides to get up here, Joe. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Final minute. Front kick to the body by McGregor. Oh! Clearly hurt. Oh! The kick lands, he's hurt, he's down. And now starting to snap off that jab. Thirty seconds now to go in the round. He missed that kick. But Gregor gets tagged with that jab. Oh! Pretty good weapon for him. Oh! 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 Nice takedown. The next there with the punch. Man, what a fight! Big 
big shot lands and a knockdown. And here another big shot lands and another knockdown. And here another clean shot lands and another knockdown. Incredible round with several moments where it looked like it might be over. Thank you very much, Ariane. Celeste is here. Third round on the way. Just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Big shot to the liver, he buckles. He's hurt to the body. Trying to take the back, I think. Full guard here. Oh, nice job here staying busy off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Big punch from the bottom. And he's going to move to pass into half guard. Oh, nice work from the bottom. Tags him with the punch. And he winds up on top. Trujillo got to be careful as he's trying to get back up to his feet that he doesn't expose himself to the hooks. Conor McGregor with some body shots. Yeah, Joe, these are absolutely punishing shots to the body. Oh. Big shot to the head. He's stunned. He's in trouble. He's got him hurt here. He's in a lot of trouble. Nice leg kick. lands an outside leg kick of his own. They are trading huge punches here. How about that shin? He slips the punch nicely there. Oh, landed that inside leg kick. Already a welt on his opponent. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. The counter left is excellent. McGregor gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. Well, he is really starting to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Excellent movement on the ground here. Constantly moving, constantly staying busy. It appears the cut on his cheek is getting worse. And lose it to half guard. Gets up again here, but hurt. Crippling uppercut for him there. Almost oh. hits him with that left hook. Oh, whoa. He's got him hurt here. Man, has his chin been tested early. There's a nice inside oh. leg kick. Gregor just pouring it on, and he wins this fight by KO. Yeah, Joe, just the way he drew it up as he gets the knockout victory here tonight, it's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. Caught him right there, had him in all sorts of trouble. Check it out here. Oh, man. K.O. 
So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Now we go inside the octagon. Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 23 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the notorious Hunter McGregor! Well, we're getting used to saying it, Conor McGregor, your winner yet again as he continues what has been one of the most remarkable legacies in UFC history. And when the lights are at their brightest, as they were here tonight, the notorious Conor McGregor seems to come through with one of his vintage performances. A huge win for Conor McGregor on the big stage here tonight.